tree trunk crying. The prophet used to stand on a tree trunk to do. Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. It's your girl Fanny Lungu back with another reaction video. If you're new to this channel, make sure to give this video a thumbs up, share it with your friends, and of course, don't forget to subscribe. Like I said, my name is Fanny Lungu, and on this channel, we do reaction videos. And you guys can feel free to drop us a link in the description and not description, I always say description in the comment section below and we'll actually look into your suggestion. Other than um, reactions, we've got a second YouTube channel called Funny and Jesse 2.0. You guys can check it out. We post some amazing vlogs and we post over the weekends. So you can just head there and enjoy the content that's there. Other than that, we've got a podcast called Diving In with Funny and Jesse. We've got some amazing conversations and you guys can just head there. If you have time listen to them and just enjoy what we what we're putting out we've also got a patreon account funny and jesse you can rather feel free to become a member and for everything else that i'm forgetting you can go to the description box and you'll find the links to everything that we do and you guys just feel free or find the time to actually check out what we do you might end up enjoying all the content that we're putting out a big shout out to everyone that's been subscribing so far thank you very much thank you for subscribing thank you for liking thank you for sharing thank you for watching and thank you for suggesting things and just thank you in general and i hope you guys are doing all right i'm so excited today i'm reacting to stuff i've never reacted to and it's just amazing and since the request to or rather suggestions were piling up i said i think i'll be reacting to um the stuff that you guys give us to react to instead of just letting them pop and just maybe sometimes ended up not doing 50 or something percent of them otherwise and there's someone that asked me where my boyfriend was um right now he is busy with school and i'm sure once he's done with whatever he's doing he'll be able to join us by posting reactions every day like i'm doing otherwise all the best to him in his exams and everything that he has to do and hope that satisfied the person hope that's a satisfactory answer otherwise we're good and i hope you guys stay blessed so as you can tell from the title i'll be reacting to the miracles of prophet muhammad Peace be upon him. So without wasting time, let's get into the video. Allah sent many prophets throughout history to guide humanity. They taught people about the pure creed of belief in the one God, ways to worship him, and how to lead righteous lives keeping in mind our purpose in life. The prophets also informed humanity of future events and things unseen such as the day of resurrection, and the life hereafter. The prophets were all outstanding examples, of honesty and righteousness, known for their pure character, even before being tasked with prophethood. The final prophet, Muhammad, peace be upon him, was given many miracles throughout his life as well. When Muhammad, peace be upon him, and his companions were once traveling, their water supply ran out. According to one of his companions, the Prophet had a small container of water, in which, he put his hand, and the water started spouting out between his fingers, like springs. So, we drank, and performed ablution. Even, if we had been one hundred thousand, that water would have been sufficient for us. Anyhow, we were one thousand five hundred. Events similar to this also occurred many times during his life. Muhammad, peace be upon him, miraculously healed others as well. He treated his cousin, Ali, when he was inflicted with an eye infection. One of his companions said, the Prophet spat in his eyes, and invoked good on him, and be became all right, as if he had no ailment.
during a period of severe drought, in Arabia, one of Prophet's companions beseeched him to ask God, to send rain. The Prophet raised his hands in prayer, and within moments a cloud appeared in the horizon, coming in their direction. One of his companions stated, when it came in the middle of the sky, it spread and then rained. By God! We could not see the sun for a week. After seven days of non-stop rain, a Shahaba, implored him to ask God, to stop the rain, as the constant downpour was overwhelming. The Prophet raised his hands in supplication, and moments later, the sun, gradually began to appear as the clouds parted, moving away from the area. Tree Trunk Crying The Prophet used to stand on a tree trunk, to deliver the Friday sermons. A Shahaba, offered to build a proper pulpit for him, and the Prophet obliged. However, when he used it for the first time, a loud crying sound came from the tree trunk. Many of Prophet's companions witnessed this firsthand, and heard what sounded like a child crying. The Prophet descended from the pulpit, and embraced it until its weeping eventually subsided. He then explained to his companions, it was crying for, missing, what it used to hear of religious knowledge, given near it. The ability to stir emotions in plants and animals, including an inanimate object as in this instance, was one of many miracles granted to Muhammad, peace be upon him. Once, one of Muhammad's, peace be upon him, companions invited him, and a few others to a meal that could feed a small group. The Prophet accepted the invitation, and to the host's dismay, called all thousand of his companions to join him in the meal. Yet, Muhammad, peace be upon him, personally served all of them from the small dish, until each one ate his fill. In the end, the tray of food remained, just as full, as it was, at the beginning of the meal. This was an amazing blessing and a clear miracle from God, which happened many times during his life. One of the most dramatic miracles took place in Mecca, when the disbelievers once challenged Muhammad, peace be upon him, to perform a miracle. He was inspired by God to point to the moon, which split into two completely separate halves. It remained that way for some time, before eventually converging back together. The disbelievers could not believe their eyes, and calling it, magic. However, this miraculous, supernatural, event was a crystal clear sign that, Muhammad, was indeed a prophet of God. Ishra refers to the night journey, Muhammad, peace be upon him, undertook with the angel Jibreel, traveling from Mecca to Jerusalem shortly, before his migration to Medina. This was a miraculous event, because, it was humanly impossible to travel this distance in such a short period at the time. From Jerusalem, Muhammad, peace be upon him, ascended to the heavens in what is called Miraj, where he held communion with God. By the time, Muhammad, peace be upon him, returned to Mecca, it was still night. When he told about his journey, people laughed. But, a close companion, Shahaba, and first Khalifa, Abu Bakr, said. He tells me revelations come to him from heaven to earth, in one hour of day or night, and I know him to be speaking the truth. Foretelling the Future In addition to performing physical miracles, Muhammad, peace be upon him, also foretold many future events. For example, he mentioned, a time would come, when shepherds will compete in constructing tall buildings. This prophecy is clearly evident for all to observe, as it manifests itself in the Arab Gulf today. Until just a century ago, the Arabs in the Gulf region were in fact living a more primitive shepherd lifestyle, as compared to the rest of the world. This all changed with the arrival of massive oil wealth, in the mid-20th century, with much of the resulting, wealth, being invested in erecting skyscrapers, across the region.
to think this video was still going on um these some of these are new to me other than the fact that um there was only one thing foretelling the future i'm aware of that but the first one i had no idea he used to heal people the tree bark crying tree trunk crying what else there's something else that shocked me not the rain is not otherwise either way all of these were all almost all new to me and it's something interesting to come across are these new to you guys as well or you are aware of these and if there's anything that you'd like to add to this let us know in the comment section below and we'll be very very appreciated make sure make sure to give this video a thumbs up share it with your friends and of course you don't know, forget to subscribe and thank you to the person that suggested this without and i'll see you next time